What's up, y'all? Good news, I fixed my phone somehow. Um, it's charging right now, but, uh, yeah. You know, I noticed some people say that they got pink toes or um, basically saying that they got someone under their feet that they really don't, meaning me, me, the real me, I'm me, um, you don't have me under your feet. Because the reason why I went out to Vegas was once again to meet with Christians, and hopefully, I was hoping to meet with like I said, a woman. But she didn't show up, and neither did these so called Christians. And if those were the Christians that were supposedly supposed to show up, they proved to me that they were not Christian because they mocked. Um, and as Paul wrote, no mocker has eternal life. Um, And I know I've repeat I've repeated this several times, but I don't believe that I would be continually repeating this if God didn't want you all to make to know this. Um but as far as you know, someone asked me today if I'm okay. I said yeah. But truthfully, I don't know. I don't know if I'm okay or not. I just... A lot of things that I've said were taken out of context or misquoted. And it's tiring to deal with it. And, uh... You know, I've told people before that I love them and all this. And, you know, when I told peop when I tell someone I love them, I mean that I love them. I don't just use love as a materialistic word. Meaning a word that I just throw around randomly. When I love you, I love you. If I don't love you, I don't. Um, and I'm not going to, you know, sit there and tell you to your face I love you and lie to you. You know, I played a song when I went out to Vegas. I played a couple songs, but I played one by uh, Justin Timberlake, Cry Me a River. It's the only song I like by him. But, um... A lot of people took it as, I should be crying them a river. And, you know, I did cry a lot this year, in this past year. It's actually been the first time in several years that I've actually been able to cry and actually shed tears. And I'm being honest, I there was a time where I could not cry. My eyes were dry and I just I couldn't cry. But this past year and this year I've done so much reflection over my life and I couldn't help but not cry. You know, I'm not that old. I'm only 29, but I've done a lot of crappy things to people in my life. And I've done, I put myself through a lot of crappy situations. And, you know, I just, reviewing that stuff, it breaks my own heart. That I would have done that. And it breaks my heart that people that continually tell me that they love me, but obviously show me that they don't, that breaks my heart and that makes me cry as well. Because I don't, I don't think people understand that they shouldn't be using that word lightly in the ways that they do. I don't believe someone should say to someone, I always loved you, but not show that you've always loved that person. And I'm just being honest. Love is not a light word. It's a heavy one. And, you know, 
some of us actually take it in full meaning. And that is a problem with today's world is so many people throw that word around like it's nothing. But how many people actually go through life really not knowing what that word really means? And then they have it stuck in their head, you know. They don't, they'll never know what love really is. And I'm just going to say, people throwing up this and this means nothing to me. I don't care who who you think you are. I don't care, you know, I've been through all that stuff in my life. I repented of it because that's what Christ told me to do. Because this stuff brings a lot of baggage around. I'm just, again, I am just being honest. Christ means more to me than that stuff. Real love means more to me than that stuff. I'm the one who's white. I'm white. I went to places to not sin but to teach Christ's teachings and to show real love. I don't own a white t-shirt or nothing, though. So, yeah. I'm the dude that would never screw over someone I say that I love. I'm also the dude that's been screwed over by every almost everybody who's said who says they love me? But you know what? I continue to love. Genuinely. Because that's who I am. That's it. Peace.